Hello everybody and welcome back to another Nihility only episode. Today we are going to be finishing off the Penacone story, taking on some of the hardest bosses which we will ever have to face in the series. We're going to be getting more character upgrades, hopefully being able to beat the boss to get my final Black Swan upgrades. We're going to be doing some more warping and a lot more to come in today's episode. But without further ado, let's get into today's Nihility only episode. But before we do get into today's Nihility only episode, I really would appreciate it if you could go down and click that little subscribe button. It really only does take a couple seconds and a lot of time and effort really does go into these videos. And I know it could take a lot of effort to go down and click a little button, but it really is only two seconds and it helps my channel grow a lot so we can keep producing high quality videos for you guys. But with that all being said, I'm excited for today's video. I hope you are too. So let's get in to some of the hardest content we'll ever have to do. Anyways, we got a long episode ahead of us. And first thing we need to do is get through this area, which the Bloodhound family member is guarding. Get out of my way. Firefly needs to move. In between episodes, I did unlock Clocky, so we can now change emotions. This is like one of my favorite mechanics in the entire game. Personally, I always like to just make people cry because it's always really funny. Psychotherapy session. You, you might need a psychotherapy session, my friend. Oh, no. We've just scarred a guy for life. I'm sorry, man. All right, we got through. Let's go. We can go to the next area. But before we continue with the story, we have something important that we must do. If you guys remember, at the start of the episode, I talked about Black Swan. And what do we need to do for Black Swan? Unlock her traces. And I know I keep bringing this up like every episode, but this time I have a legitimate strategy for beating this bug. So in between episodes, I took some pretty drastic preparations in order to beat this boss fight because it's been damn near four to three episodes and we still haven't beat the thing. And it's time for me to finally be able to defeat it. In between episodes, you guys actually left me a ton of helpful comments. And one that I like to point out in particular is one person who suggested that I pick up this material right here, the prayer machine, which every single turn that passes by for the first five turns, we're gonna regain a thousand HP, which for a challenge like this, is absolutely ginormous because we don't really have a way to sustain ourselves and so with a consumable like this we now have a way to easily sustain our characters for long amounts of time so in between episodes i went and i bought the material and then i crafted a few of them so that we can use it to beat this boss i think it's time we finally kill this damn bug let's go in it for one final time here we go we've done every preparation we could think of or at least that i could think of it's time i am so prepared for this we're gonna single target we're gonna outspeed him on this first turn because we do get the speed boost from my topological acceleration band which is one of the consumables i had never in my life have i been more ready to kill a boss oh god oh <laughs> he does so much damage Okay, there we go. We, we killed him. Nice, 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 nice. Now I use Well Burst. Now we use Well Burst and Pala Burst. There we go. And now he has re everything on the field. Reduce speed, reduce defense. This is amazing. Apply Quantum. Good. Halfway down. Oh, God. Oh, God. He does so much. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, we can break the big guy, though. Pala's down. However, this is very bad. Okay, let's go for the bugs so they explode, and that's going to do more damage to the big guy. Okay, one exploded, two exploded, three, 55, 48. We're so close. 39%. Oh my gosh. Luca, no. I don't think we're going to get it. Oh no. We're so close. Come on, Welt. I need you to, I need you to do crazy damage with this. Slow everything. 28%. Oh no. 22. Oh no, it's over. It's over. Okay, our HP artifacts are proving helpful. 17%. No! 17! Okay, Luca, big break. Boom! 25%. Why did that do so much? Oh my goodness, Luca. Luca nearly just killed the thing. And it, oh my goodness, we're on second half. I don't know what just happened, but I'm not complaining. Luca just annihilated that thing. 
Boom. Come on. Everything reduced speed. Huge. Get that impair. Nice. Okay, those things are going to explode. We're going to have to kill them. I think we have to kill the exploding ones first. We can't let them explode. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. Silver Wolf. Okay, we're going to need to break this one. Nice. He's dead. Huge. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, my goodness. We might be able to do it. Holy crap. Luca, please just do, like, ginormous damage. 42%. That is amazing. Oh, my gosh. We're so close. Please just don't do a huge move that kills me. Anything? Okay. That's fine. Okay. We can do it. We can do it. I believe I'm using all my strongest moves. Come on. 2%. 1%. Yes. Oh, my gosh. We did it. Yes. Goodbye, bug. Six seconds. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I am in a small amount of shock right now. That, that actually just shocked me. I didn't think it was possible. But Luca, I'm not sure what you did, but you are an absolute monster, my friend. I'm going to have to replay that footage, but I think he did like 60 to 40% damage in a single hit when he broke that bug. Ron May, please never send me on a mission like that again. Jesus Christ. Ain't even going to cap Ron May. You ain't welcome aboard the express after what you put me through. Jesus Christ. Oh, and there's another mission. But luckily, the boss fight is unlocked now. And luckily, now that we have the boss fight completely unlocked, we are able to use support characters from other people, which could include healers, meaning that we are now past the hard part. Thank God. But anyways, I have to go beat this bug three more times. We'll be right back. And we're done. Battle over. Let's see. Do we get the god piece? Let's see. Boots. HP. Genuinely, I lock every HP piece. And other one, like I said. Anyways, with that, we can finally, finally upgrade our black swan traces. Oh my goodness. We now do more skill, burn, shock stuff let's go we now uh do more stuff that's a lot of text i just know it's good and we got one more boom oh and look at all these that we can get too wind damage attack percent effect hit rate and more attack percent let's go and with that we finally somewhat finished our black swan traces we may get a couple of these in the future but as you can see uh my credit count is currently twenty nine thousand. not too great what stands before you is Golden Hour. What are your first impressions of the city? I fell in love at first sight. Yeah, I fell in love with the city. I've been in love with the city ever since I was born. We are in a very hardcore relationship. Aww. Enemies, I can take those on. I'm feeling more confident now. Boom! Somebody should record how many times I say boom per episode because I feel like I say it at least 20 times minimum per episode. Investigate. Oh, a birdie. Sarcastic bird. I hate sarcastic people. Hey, yo, is it just me or is that robot kind of fruity? Hey, yo, what? Why is it standing like that? Oh, God, don't hurt me. I'm sorry. Oh, jigsaw puzzles. I was always great at these as a kid. Here we go. Oh. And pinball time. Ba -ba 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 Boom. And we made it. What is with all the balloons around here? One snake balloon, two snake balloon, three snake balloon, four, five, six, seven. Oh, they're just everywhere. The countless fireflies chasing the fire. Get it? Because her name is Firefly? <laughs> uh, bro, the views from here are magnificent. That's just the whole way we came down here, all the way up here, and you can just look over all of it. Why are the pieces floating? Oh, oh. Goodbye. Well, great. There won't be too many hindrances after this. Oh, for real? Oh. Not too many hindrances, she said. Okay. Bro, got the dinosaur chef cooking up. What the hell is this? I don't even know what this dinosaur really does. All I know is that it looks dangerous and I'm kind of scared of it. Oh, God. What's that do? Oh, stove healing. Oh, well, hey, can't, can't heal anything that's dead. Two stacks of stove healing have been applied. Well, what the hell does it do? Oh, he just explodes. <laughs> okay. Well, that works out. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, yeah, that works out for me then. Goodbye. Oh, it's time for the most beautiful view in the entire game. Oh my gosh, this has got to be the best moment in the whole game. Oh, look at the starry sky. Make a wish. I wish to get seven Acherons. I think it's going to come true now. Entropy loss syndrome. Have you heard of this term? 
The hell do I look like? A dictionary? No, I've not heard of that term. Entropy loss syndrome. An irreversible chronic disassociation of the physical body, resulting in slowly fading away. The person can run, talk, and jump like normal, but the disease makes them slower. Oh, so she just has Parkinson's. We'll just say that next time. Why do people choose to sleep? Uh, they usually do it because they're, uh, because they're tired most of the time. Because they're afraid to wake up from the dream. Yeah, that that ain't it, Chief. Hey, can we end this conversation? I, I see that bird over there. I kind of need to pick that up. Aha, uh -huh, you thought you could hide from me no more. Gossipy bird. I love how all these birds have different acronyms. It's really funny. Oh, yeah. Also, in between episodes, I also unlock the, the clocky statue. Do we have anything we can do to upgrade this? Ooh, yeah, pay. Ooh, we got three levels for that boy. Okay. Give me 40 Stellar Jades, 600 Travelers EXP. Let's go. And speaking of Stellar Jades, something I actually noticed in between episodes is that Black Swan's Eidolon 1 is actually super, super OP for Nihility only. Seven Pillars of Wisdom. Basically, whenever enemies are inflicted with any DOTs, they're going to have their corresponding resistance to that DOT reduced by 25%, which is actually really, really good. Now, obviously, that being said, Acheron is coming up. But we're just, uh, building pity because Gwenyphon's on the banner and she's a good four star. So we could also possibly get some nice Eidolons, right? Shoot. <laughs> At least give me Gwenyphon. Oh, let's go. We got another Gwenyphon. See, it was worth it. Hell yeah. And a Ting Yoon. Actually, I didn't have a Ting Yoon yet. Okay, cool. New character. I think I'm willing to expend one more temple for the chance of E1 Gwenaifen, but this is all I'm doing. I swear this is all I'm doing because I don't have an addiction and I do not have a gotcha problem. Please give me it. Please give me it. <laughs> no, we got a Ting Yoon. Unlucky. That's unfortunate. Not much we can do about that. One Ting Yoon copy and I do not think I want to risk it anymore. I think we're going to leave it there for the day. Oh, ho, ho. Would you look who it is? Not what are you? What the hell do you want? Sampo Koski, isn't it? It's finally time for the faded meeting. Sampo Koski for Sampo Koski. Could you, could you back off? I'm trying to have an epic moment here. Meet again, my dear. Uh, that's not a positive thing. Um, excuse me. Is he trying to seduce us? Hey, yo, what the hell? What the hell? Sparkle. Yo. Uh, <laughs> Sparkle. Uh. What the? No, why would you? Oh. Man, I'm so sick of getting betrayed by every single character in this arc. Can we just make one friend? Sparkle. I need to vent my anger. Where are you, Sparkle? You sticker. Go into corner and put Avertrine over you. Oh, let's go. We got to do more Spider-Man movements. Hell yeah. Climbing up walls and shit. And we're off the wall. Saved again. And I get one stellar jade for my efforts. Hell yeah. Monkey man. Yeah, no, I'm good. I'll pass on that. I, I ain't into that today. Oh, Jesus Christ. What is this room? Uh, oh, God. How am I going to get to that? By running. I'm a genius. Man, bro, what pose is that man doing? These TVs always got the goofiest poses. Oh, my God. And did, did I? anyone else just see that? Damn, that was impressive. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Ooh, big chest, and it's blue. Grand Duke Rogue, the god piece. Uh, maybe for Welt. We insist that the dreamscape is absolutely safe. Yeah, well, clearly they lie, and I don't know what to tell you. Oh, uh, there's going to be something terrifying behind this door, isn't there? You can just feel the ominous atmosphere. Oh. Okay, if that's not a death flag, I don't know what is. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Oh, what do you know? It was a trap. That's crazy. This music is scaring the ever-living hell out of me. What the hell? When did we get into Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Place? Bro, stop. Oh, my God. The fire alarm is not necessary. Jeez. God, that's so loud, too. Okay, well, if you know, it's hurting my eyes, too. Oh, we can't leave anymore. Oh, great. Oh, God. Fi Can we stop with the fire alarm? Oh, God. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
Oh no. Oh no. It has two HP bars? This is going to be hard. Um, all right. Here we go. Oh, this is not going to be easy, is it? Oh god, the thing does damage too. Oh my goodness, it does damage. Okay. Memory zone meme. Meme? Okay, something onto death. Well, yeah, it's about to probably give me death in about two seconds. I was not prepared for this boss fight. Luckily, we do have all the right elements, but oh, it's not looking good. This thing does damage. We're going to need to get probably some buffs up in here, I imagine. We're going to put the blast attack on it. Boom, there we go. And then, oh god. what? Oh no, cough go. Oh! Okay, luckily we did damage there, but it has two HP bars and we're already on low health. This is bad news bears. Okay, we need to break Kafka out. Okay, we got Kafka out of the imprisonment. Good. Come on. Boom. One more. Second phase. Here we go. Wait, what? 1%? Oh, God. Oh, God. Whoa! Oh, God. Okay. Um. Okay, we need to free our main units there. Okay, they, they are both at full health. Good. That's very good. And we already got it down to 62%. We are destroying this thing. Oh god, oh god, that did damage. Okay, we need to do our burst. Get some stacks of Arcana on the enemy. Kafka's dead. When did when did Kafka die? 50%. Kafka dying there is really bad. 33% though. And all of our bursts just got activated. I'm not sure why, but I'm not complaining. We're gonna slow the thing with Welt. The enemy's doing a very scary movement right now. It has that claw ready to kill me. Okay. We're gonna use your burst. This should be good. And then we can probably break it with Gwenyphon. Okay, no, Gwenyphon won't break it, but we can break it with Welt. There we go. Boom, 1%. Final hit. Kill it, Gwenyphon. Yes! First try, baby! How was it? Did you dream of- Yes, yes. In fact, I did. But thanks to you, we might be able to use this opportunity to get to know each other a little- Oh, we can be friends. Oh, maybe Black Swan won't betray us like everybody else did. Aw. Hacker Girl. Silver Wolf. Man, we are seeing every single Nihility character this episode. The hell are you doing here? Anyways, we're going back into the dream pool. Let's go. Black Swan just spent all that time getting us out just for us to go back in. Oh, look who's back. Acheron, what's good? Welcome back, Acheron. I'm happy to see you again. I can't wait for you to come home next update. Oh, we're back in the mystical land. I never enjoy coming back to the dreamscape. It scares the living hell out of me. And frankly, after that last one where I almost got scarred by the fire alarm, the fire alarm is not necessary. <laughs> Jeez, um, I'm not looking forward to coming here again. Open sesame. Never mind. Another open sesame. Jesus Christ, how many doors can we possibly have? Oh, but of treasure. What's this? Nothing. Oh, but this, however, this looks important. The Path of Dream Dive. We have new relic sets. Now, this one is slightly meaningless to us. However, this one, the Pioneer Diver of Dead Waters, is actually super useful for this account. Now, this relic set isn't going to be good on most of our main DOT characters. Like, for example, Black Swan doesn't want to use it. Gwenyphon doesn't want to use it. However, for a character like Welt, for example... He can make really, really good use of this set because he's like our main damage dealer and having him with good crit rate and damage is important. Not to mention, no matter what team he's in, he's always going to be beside a bunch of Nihility characters. So I actually want to start grinding this set for my wealth. So I will be right back after we do a couple relic runs. See you guys in a minute. And I think with that, we have used all our Trailblaze power and... Let's see if we got any good pieces in that set that we were looking for. We didn't get too much, but we did get a little bit. We got way more of this Watchmaker set than we did of the set that we wanted. But let's at least see. Uh, we got attack percent and HP, not the greatest. Crit damage break effect, okay. Meh. Crit rate, that could actually be good for well. Attack percent with speed as a substat is pretty nice. HP and some HP boots. Not the best pieces ever. We'll at least try one of them. See what we can get, maybe... We get something terrible. Okay, yeah, that's not good. We did get a crit rate body, though. Maybe this one changes my mind. Okay, it won't change my mind. But imagine if this one rolls straight speed and effect hit rate. You never know. Okay. Firefly! Oh, I can't wait to see her again. 
Oh, I can't wait to see her again. I love her character, man. She's like one of my favorites. She's just like a really super likable, super relatable character who I feel like I, you know, I can attest a lot of myself to. And to be honest, she's just really cute and also like a well-designed <laughs> character. You know, I'm really excited to roll for her banner. And this character is just so amazing. There's so- oh! <laughs> Why is she blue goo? It's fine, guys. She just died in the dream world. It's fine. She just died in the dream world. It's fine. It was my hesitation that caused her to lose her life. No, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't worry about it. She's alive. I'm not even stressed, man. She's alive. It's not your fault. It's, it's chill, man. She's fine. May death be the end of your boundless dream. Man, what's with these parting words? She's alive. Stop it. Hoyoverse don't kill off characters. Have you played Genshin Impact? It's all colors and sunshine, man. They don't kill characters. That doesn't happen. Is what I'm gonna tell myself to cope with the loss. Oh man, bro. I've just gone into a state of depression. I don't even know what to do anymore now that she's gone. How do I continue playing? What is there to do in this game anymore without her, man? I guess I'll get my bubbles and I'll keep doing what I'm supposed to. Yeah, let's... Yeah, could you leave me alone, man? I don't really want to fight right now, bro. I'm not in the mood. Okay, let's let's just drop... Let's just drop a chandelier. We landed safely. I kind of wish I fell to my death, but whatever. No, not a monkey. Are you kidding me? I don't want to. Oh, not a monkey, man. Boom. If he's anything like the other monkey I remember from this game, then we might be a little bit screwed, actually, because that other monkey is a, a powerful one, to say the least. And to be honest, this one's kind of just a retexture of the other monkey, but whatever. Come on, we got this. Throw down the hand. Throw down the gauntlet. Boom. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's a lot of speed boosts. Huh? Oh, God. It's eating so much. Just, get, just keep on applying DOT and we'll be fine. Activate it all with Kafka. And oh, my goodness, Kafka. What the heck? God damn. Okay. Place. Oh, look at that whale. That thing's ginormous. Maybe I should whale on the hillity only. Uh-oh. Everyone. Over there. Uh, I'm not prepared for another boss fight. You know what hell I just went through? I don't have the mental fortitude to go through another one. Oh, God. Hi there. Hey. Okay, well, warning taken. Okay, I guess we leave then. Oh, never mind. Okay. Uh, who the hell? Oh, I remember this guy. We saw him yesterday. He was talking to Silver Wolf in the lobby. I remember him. I don't know what importance he has, but he's a Stellaron Hunter, not one that I recognize. But anyways, here we go. He has no weaknesses. Uh, we have no way of killing him, and he does crap loads of damage. Fun. <laughs> this is going to be good. I can, I can already feel it. How does he have no weaknesses? This is ridiculous. None? None at all? You can't have one freaking weakness, man? Uh, can we even slow him? Tell me I can slow him. I can't slow him. He's effect resistance. Are you freaking kidding me? Oh, God. Oh, my God. No, he's doing the Himiko. He did the Himiko move. What does that fire ring do? When consuming combustible skill points, the attacking ally loses HP and additional deals a set amount of fire damage equal to 30% of the original damage. Oh, God. So I just can't use skills? Oh, God. Kafka. Oh, this is bad. This is very, very bad. Okay, we might need to prepare a little bit. First thing we're going to do, add Silver Wolf to the team. He did have a quantum weakness and Silver Wolf will help us beat that quantum weakness. That also means we'll have a full team of five stars. We're going to activate the exact same food buffs that we talked about earlier. We're going to get that 1000 HP a turn and we're going to get that increase in speed. Good stuff. We could throw up an enhance and now uh, we have to go again. Okay, here we go. Round two, baby. Here we go. You shouldn't be here. I agree, but yet we're still here. Uh, here we go again. Okay, there we go. He has weaknesses again. Good stuff. Uh, unfortunately, we can't exploit any of them or else we take damage. But I don't really have a choice. Here we go. We are going to restore 1,000 HP a turn. That's exactly what we need. We're going to apply all this Arcana to him. And now our goal is just to break him down. Belittle him. Make fun of him. Let's go again. We're going to use Kafka Blast. Activate every DOT. 69%. 68. And now he has to talk to us for a little bit in monologue. We get it. You're big and epic, man. 
Himiko ultimate, except it's Sam. Jesus Christ, that does damage. What the heck? Okay, we got to slow him. Please get it well. Please get it. Please slow him. Oh, effect resistance again? You got to be kidding me. Okay, his fire thing is gone now. Thank heavens. Fire thing's gone. We can safely use our ultimate abilities. Please just do crap tons of damage. 22, 15. Oh, God. Boom. 3%. We got it. Oh, we got it. Easy. 1% and the final one. Boom. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Okay, we're good. Oh, thank God. Oh, well, who, what the hell are you what doing here? Show. Oh, you make me so uncomfortable. As promised, I've delivered the child to you. No. Our transaction is complete. No, you betrayed me too. This is just one smack in the face after another. Oh my goodness. And with that, I think we're going to end the episode here for today. We've been betrayed by Black Swan, saw our favorite character die. Somehow, we're able to beat three of the hardest bosses in the game today with just Nihility characters. To be honest, I know I've said this a lot this episode, but I'm still in some amounts of shock. No healers to speak of on our whole account, just Nihility, and we were able to do it. I'm very proud of us. That is the end of the Panacone story and the end of today's episode of Nihility Only. Thank you guys so much for watching today, and I'm going to see you all in the next one. Peace.